Hello again, in this video we'll look at how we can add the series name onto a scatter chart or a bubble chart. Um, I've got some very simple data set up here to allow us to do that. Unfortunately in Excel if we simply go and try to do this fairly fairly quickly we get some bizarre stuff uh, and it's actually quite difficult to to call it anything because when we had a look at the what the options are a series name comes up like that and we want to get a b and c um, so that's not ideal so i just clear all that so what we have to do is start with a blank chart so we can pick a bubble chart or a scatter chart and you know it looks blank so what we have to do is make sure we're clicking on the chart to bring up chart design menu select data and then just add each of these individually so we've got a, the name, we've got the X value, and then we've got the, the Y value. And I'll just clear that OK. And you can see 8 versus 9 is appearing. OK, I'm going to continue to do that. Uh, again, select data, and then add, and then continue on. I'll just pause the video while I do that. OK, I've just added A, B, and C. So you can see they're just picking up these values across here two and five okay so you can just continue on doing that and you can see we've got a, a scatter chart appearing and now we want to add the labels so we go into data labels over here go to more options we want the series name and we don't want anything else and you, you can have them in the uh, there or, or above or wherever you wanted to have if you wanted the center then you have to go through and remove the marker uh, as well but basically that's all we have to do and once we're in this menu we can just quickly uh, do the others as well and um, the same thing applies if we do a a bubble chart 